Yo man, what's good everybody man? Welcome back to many video guys. This is your boy FJCJ11. If you guys are new to the channel, um, I am a Pixian 3D content creator and I pretty much go over some of the latest news from Pixian 3D and as well as test out new weapons and pretty much showcase everything of new updates for this game. Now, in today's video guys, we'll be looking at the brand new patch notes for the 24.4 11th anniversary for Pixagon 3D. It's going to be 11 years since Pixagon 3D has been out and I'm going to showcase everything you guys need to know about this update if you guys have not seen it already. So make sure you guys please leave a like, subscribe guys and I hope you guys do enjoy today's video and hey man, let's get started today's video. Alright guys, so guys, we're going to be going over everything you guys need to know. So we're already on the patch note of 24 and if you guys want the link to the patch notes it'll be in the link in the description and also if you guys don't know if you guys joined the pixagun 3d discord you guys will also see this available for you guys in the announcements so um yeah anyways guys let's get cracking down to business starting off where it says pixagun is racing towards its 11th birthday with pixel punch pinata the safe one this time balloons birthday cake and tons of activities some exciting events are waiting for you in this update and the most lore deep season in the last two years but first things first is uh the portalius latest invention should help him put an end to all resistance a single hub that makes travel between all portals possible distance worlds and uncharted corners of the universe are now at arm's length ready to become a dungeon for anyone who gets in the villain's way and so on and so forth this is just pretty much about the new season we're not gonna read too much of this you know what i'm saying uh we're gonna get straight to the business of pg 3d 11th birthday it seems like we just celebrated a grand anniversary but now it's been almost a year and we're ready for a big pixagun 3d 11th birthday party for all pixel gunners we decorated maps from classic modes. Everything you need for a party set is birthday caps, balloons, pixel coke, pizza, and even fireworks by the classic pool. But the most important thing is one you can place in the armory. Get ready to view, review your loadout as you will find weapon sets belonging to the most dangerous villains in the pixel gun universe. Skins for classic weapons, fresh guns from the pixel pass, and new pet and a new veteran set it looks like we're getting a new veteran set and of course the traditional lottery with weapons of your choice this will a uh, chance to enlarge your armory with not only new works of pixel art but the most popular firearm classics in the game so it looks like the 11th birthday is going to be introducing many cool things especially uh, probably a new veteran set i'm not sure but <laughs> this is looking pretty dope right now and now guys we're going to be talking about the multiverse rift which as you as we've already established the heroes are facing a difficult battle once it is stages is hacking and reflashing the portal hub solving a complex technical task will require lots of parts this is where you step in you can find necessary parts with so-called shards in the classic modes participate in matches to collect shards from defeated enemies the mode changes every day so you will have experience been regularly looking for fresh tactics and trying to or trying out different loadouts for helping the heroes you will get a reward the perfect birthday party a mechanical party bot a, a festive party sniper a special for it and a glider created by a fellow pixel gunner dead man boy so it looks to me guys we're having like one of those shards if you guys are not enough an extraction mode if you guys aren't familiar with it um, they have shards that you're supposed to collect and you would use that for like rewards I think and um, So we have new rewards created by Dead man boy shout out to him and guys we have updates and reworks So with the new season comes the new tournament. We have big plans to improve it For example, thanks for your feedback. We have done away with synchronizing match login in the update 20 point or 24.4 a separate tab for tournament statics uh, statics uh, will appear in the player's profile. All necessary information will be stored, league, rank points, time until the end of the tournament, and your, and your stats pretty much. Uh, now we're going to talk about the PC edition, which our Pixel Universe has been enriched by the Steam version of Pixel 3D, which are 
also working tirelessly to improve. In the new Odo or maybe even later, PC Edition will get a fresh patch with bugs, additional settings, and long-awaited keyboard and gamepad mapping. A, a small but nice bonus we add also cards and badges to Steam. We still have a lot of work to do on polishing the game and this matter we count on your constructive feedback. You can share all your wishes through our social networks or comments in the news and our Steam page. Pixel Gunners who reason have not yet managed to check out the PC edition, we encourage you to give it a try and if you already played at least two hours and don't think about stopping there, please make sure to write a positive review on Steam. Um, and guys, we're gonna map rotations. Now, we guys know, um, team, in Team Fight, Parkour City, 3, 2, 1, and Ice Pilots are going on a vacation, which means they're gonna be replaced by Heaven Garden, Candyland, and uh, D-Day, which uh, is an OG map, yeah. And Warehouse, Assault, and Wars of Toys will be replaced, the White House, and China maps, and Deathmatch, plus Parkour City will join the point capture mode. I wish they could also change the duels uh maps a little bit uh just get something new in there um and also focus on other modes as well like battle royale and mini games i feel like those also need to be touched but for now we're gonna focus on the 24.4 news right now and then communities all sorts of activities await with pixel gunners not only in the game but also on the other side of the screen we plan contests and lots of them right now we're giving away merch and dlcs on instagram and determining which gun, avatar, gadget, and whatever you create will end up in Pixie Gun 3D in one of the next updates. So they're gonna be announcing and they're gonna be creating more opportunities for people to get creative and have their own stuff in the game and also give do a lot of giveaways soon. So we didn't really, really touch on this topic as much, but bug fixes. We got fix an issue with adjustment uh, volume of the orbital complex map in the flag capture mode. Same thing with sneak and seek and also campaign. Uh, I feel like they also need to fix a little bit more because there's like still some like uh, sound going on even though you don't have sound effects on, which uh, hopefully they can fix that. And so fix a bug with displaying skins in the glass passage of our, uh, you know, parkour city three, two, one. And also we got fix a bug causing the map or causing the act to crash after connected to a match and so on and so forth. It's not really that much difference. And they definitely fixed the buttons with the seven and eight when you were able to create the gadgets from it, like the nuke and the uh, fire mushroom. And um, yeah, man, uh, that's pretty much it for this uh, upcoming update. Uh, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about this update because I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty cool and. Honestly, I gotta say, uh, the birthday updates are probably one of the best updates. Uh, yeah, I like. I definitely like the 10th anniversary one. It was really dope. And uh, let's roll the outro. All right, y'all guys. So that will be it for today's video, guys. Now, if you guys have enjoyed this video and stay tuned and looked around, everything you guys need to know about the 24.4 11th anniversary update. Let me know what you guys think about it. I ain't gonna lie, it looks dope. Um, would you guys actually like play this new update? I ain't gonna lie, it might be kind of worth it. I ain't gonna lie, it might be kind of worth it, y'all. So, um, yeah, anyways, drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video. Peace. Okay.